He's going Dusty Bogan here from the Bogan headquarters. Um, want to talk to you about um, the Tucker Carlson Antifa at the guy's house, right? 20 of them, whatever, right? 8 o'clock at night, the guy's at work. They're smashing on his door. They're spray painting his driveway, carrying on like idiots, mate, right? Finally, are the people going to wake up now? Are people going to see? The Proud Boys, every time these people attacked us and we punched on, right? We defend self-defense. Self-defense. Every time. Every time. We never started a fight. These people are out of control. Now, I hope what happens is we've been taken off Facebook. They've gotten rid of the Proud Boys. They've taken away our freedom of speech. And um, you know what? Now, Antifa's turning their attention away from us. They're going after guys like Tucker, mate. Fox News contributor. What's he got? The most popular show on Fox, right? And I just hope, I just... I just think, right, I've seen all the articles written. And you know what? Are people waking up to the danger of these radical communist freaks? Have a look at the, have a look at my footage from this, the um, anti, sick, the, the safe school program we call it in Australia, right, where they want to teach 60 genders to children. We had a rally in the city and there's anti-far people. I'm filming, I'm looking at the, um, looking at my camera gear, listening to the interviews. I turn around, there's three of them pushed through the police, coming up with me with some Proud Boy sign saying, Proud Boys are gay. Well, mate, I thought, what's wrong with gay? Now you just you just contradict yourself. One guy has a hammer and sickle on his shirt. Dead set communist. Face covered. These people are radical, mate. They're, they're absolute fools. They're dangerous people. I reckon they're dangerous. And they're stupid. They're dumb. They've been used, they are being used by, I don't know, I don't know if that, how stupid they are, but they they are creating conf, unnecessary conflict where people would be happy to talk to them. I guarantee it, I would talk to them, I'd give them a voice, have a conversation with these people, but they don't want to do that. They want to yell and scream and carry on. But you know what? There's the clear evidence of these guys with a hammer and sickle. In that footage, they scream at me and they say, go back to New Zealand, Ben, go back to New Zealand. And they're racist. They're being racist. I caught them out being racist, number one. We caught them out when Stefan Molyneux came, right? They antifa, they bashed a bloody journalist in Brisbane. Five on one bashed this guy in a park, this journalist, right? We caught them out. We got him. Bam. And that same night, they stole... A kid's hat. We've got that. We've got them calling, telling me good to go back to New Zealand. They're being racist, right? Then we, I get them again. Police at this anti-safe school rally. They push through the police crowd. They're going up to an old lady screaming in her face, calling her a racist and a bigot and a and all this jargon. So, so how many times do we catch these people out? They're out of control. And I, I don't know what state it is. Some state in America has classified them as terrorist organization. I reckon that's absolutely right. They're a bunch of Muppets. And um, there is, you know what, if you go to, if you go to any conservative rally, there's no confrontation. We're just going to a rally because we're defending our values. What happened to multiculturalism? These people push 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 multiculturalism well and and then they trying to say we can't have a voice well if you believe in multiculturalism you know isn't there going to be different opinions different perspectives different cultures what about conservatives what about christians and all my hit my hindu buddhist mates at work you know, do you know what? When the, when the gay vote came around in this nation, when we voted on gay marriage, they said, Ben, get your citizenship. We want you to vote. Vote no. Vote to retain traditional marriage because they said it goes against our culture, their culture. And if you stand up for traditional values, if you're a conservative, you know what? You're standing up for family values. The, the Hindus, Buddhists, Jews, Muslim, Christians... They have these conservative values. Aboriginal Australians, 
all, all, all I know is the different ethnic groups in this nation are culturally conservative. So when we go and we have a rally, when we say all these things, these people agree with us. But it's like the thing with Kanye West when they say they need to get off the Democrat plantation. They need to get off the left plantation. They need to, you know, uh, minds need to be open to the destruction of some of these policies. Do you know what I mean? And and the truth be told, if we take away these radical um, Antifa l- losers who are just stirring up violence and confrontation... And, and all this stuff, that would cause escalation. So they're fools. It's dangerous what they're doing. But I tell you what, if you remove them, then we, we get back to the left and the right having dialogue and discussion and democracy works. And it's a beautiful, amazing thing. But do you know what doesn't work? People who don't believe in freedom of speech. People who carry on like pork chops. They're freaking dangerous. And I just hope... We've got to hope now. I think it's, you know, this can be, this could be the thing that gets these people. They're going to like, we've give, give them enough rope and they'll hang themselves, these people. They're crying like babies. They're carrying on. But you know what? They're going to do themselves in because they're violent, aggressive. They, I don't think they have any merit to what they have to say. And then we can, we can continue the conversation like normal people. When when we finally shut them down, that'll be great. I reckon that'd be great. Thanks heaps. Subscribe to uh, Dusty Bogan on YouTube and um, check me out on We Me, Me We. Sorry, and uh, find our uh, Proud Boys betting page. Come be a Proud Boy. Come for beers. Never give up. Cheers.